Vimy Ridge, a strategically important area of land in the north of France, which during the First World War was home to Canada's most important military victory and the birth of Canadian pride. During 1914, the Germans had total control of the area. The French had attempted three times to recapture Vimy, but they were unsuccessful. Late in 1916, under the command of General Julian Bing, a British officer, Canadian troops were selected to lead a new assault. Bing came up with the battle strategies and trained the Canadian troops well. Canada's main objective was to take control of the German group along the escarpment. This would ensure that the southern flank could advance without suffering German fire. April 9, 1917, at zero hour, Easter Monday, men from all regions of Canada moved into position together for the first time. In less than two hours, a well-planned attack, bravery, and support by a creeping barrage had Canadians taking their first objectives. On April 10th, they recaptured Hill 145, the highest point on the ridge. By April 12th, they had taken the last German position, the Pimple. It was a remarkable victory. Historians attribute the success of the Canadian troops to technical and tactical innovation, meticulous planning, powerful weaponry support, and thorough training as well as the failure of the German 6th Army to properly apply the new German defensive plan. The victory at Vimy Ridge marked a Canadian milestone. Canadians took great pride in the success. Success, however, came at a terrible cost, with more than 10,000 Canadians killed or wounded. In 1922, the French government granted Vimy Ridge and the area surrounding it to the people of Canada. The Vimy Ridge Memorial, built in 1936, is an emotional reminder of the 11,285 Canadians killed who have no known grave.